Hi everyone, it's Robin and I have an outdoor project to share with you. It is finally beautiful outside and it is nice enough to be outside in our outdoor spaces. So I've been trying to get our patio area down underneath our deck ready to go for the summer, but I have a few things that I'd like to spray paint. So that's what I'm going to share with you today. The first item I have to paint is this chair that I picked up at Aldi a couple weeks ago. And the second item to paint is this plant stand that I picked up at the thrift store. And you may remember it from my thrift store Thursday haul. Shelby over here. She's just having a great day sitting in the sun in the backyard and loving life. Alright, so then the final thing, I don't know if you'll be able to see it very well, but it is a plant stand or bird feeder stand. So I've had this for a couple of years and it needs some paint. I have yet to even use it because I keep thinking I'm going to paint it and then I'll use it. So now's the time. So I'm going to get that painted also. <laughs> I also forgot to say, so to protect my grass, I have a drop cloth down. And then whatever I'm painting, I always prop up on these two by fours. That way it's just up off the fabric. You can see it's over there too. And it just makes painting a whole lot easier. So the spray paint I'm going to use today is the Rust-Oleum. It is in satin heirloom white. And I have used this before many, many times. And it is my favorite white to use. It's not a bright white, but it's like an off-white kind of creamy white. I think it's perfect for outside. So this is the paint that I will use. So one little tip that I have to share when using spray paint is to make sure that you're far enough away from your project that you're not going to get a lot of drips. And the other thing I like to do is when I'm spraying the spray paint with the nozzle to make sure that I just use short bursts of spray. Kind of like I think about it as like I'm putting hairspray on my hair. Just quick little spurts. And you want to make sure that you're moving the spray can all the time. So a little spurt and then let go of the nozzle. That way you're not going to get as many drips, you're not going to waste as much paint, and you can concentrate the paint where you want it to go much more easily. So that is what my tip is. So I'm going to go ahead and get started painting and I'll show you the end result. all the painting and I ended up giving each piece two coats of paint and I think it turned out very nice. Here's what the chair looks like. The plant stand is looking very nice as well. This plant stand is also looking very spiffy in its new coat of white paint. Hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you again very soon. Bye now!